Hey everybody, what's going on? Welcome back to Rick Games and welcome to a game called Lily's Well. Um, I know very little about this game. I know that it is rated very high on Steam. And um, I know that it involves a well and a girl named Lily. And uh, very, very little else. So I also don't know how to play. Uh, I know this is very, like, 8-bit. Alright, don't start the thing again. Let's just start. Let's see where we're at here. Oh, dear lord. It's a cold, rainy day in the Tabachi household. Tabachi, sure. Ah, uh, you are Lily. Your eyes are huge. Lily's a young, innocent girl. Nine years of age. I can't tell if... Alright, this, this... The video is supposed to look like this. All staticky and stuff, right? I'm guessing. You live in a modest home with your papa. Oh, papa. That's so sweet. On this cold and rainy day, you are knitting on the couch while papa packs his things. Papa packs his things. You're testing the the windsock on my microphone. I don't have one. Today, Tonight, he needs to go to work in order to teach a night class. What does he do? Did I miss something? I can't go back. As Lily is a good child, Papa trusts you to stay safe while he's gone. Well, that's not really up to Lily, I'm guessing. Whoa! Before he leaves, Papa makes hot dogs and the box mac and cheese. My God, that is one of my favorite meals! Lily is so lucky! As he helps you pour the cheese sauce, aka powder, on your hot dog, oh, never mind, in order to make it taste better. You enjoy your meal together, ignorant of future events. <laughs> wow. Okay. Papa puts you to bed with the sounds of rain lulling you to sleep. I hear no rain. Am I asleep? Help. Someone. Ah. <laughs> uh, you awaken to the sound of a voice. That's the voice that I've given her. Him? It? The voice seems to come from outside. You look out your bedside window. Nobody. There's nobody among the rain and darkness. Game over. Was it a dream? You open your window a crack to listen closer. Crack, please. It hurts. Help. Sorry. The well. Someone is in the well! Timmy. The rope normally hanging from it has vanished. I don't know why I'm reading wrong. You are a good girl, so you get out of bed to go help. But Papa said not to. Read instructions? I think I'm going to have to. Uh, Control is using items. items. Okay. Use the arrow keys to move Lily around. Lily can also move by clicking on her desired location. Objects can be... Z on our space. Let's go with space. All right. This can also be done by clicking or tapping on the object. Oh. This game auto saves to keep track of progress. It can safely it can be safely exited most times. Okay. Using items. Certain objects and structures require okay. To use an item, okay. Open the menu screen with the escape or X key. Okay. Really? Weird. Okay, on the menu screen, select the stuff option to access collected items. Uh huh. Lily must be right in front of the item's target in order to use it. Okay. Multiple places they can be used, so don't be afraid to get creative. Item types four different types of items stuff, ropes, keys, and files. Stuff, mix up normal items, interact with objects. Okay, these often have more than one use. Okay, yada, yada, yada. Ropes are the main goal to work toward. These items are what Lily needs to climb down the well. Okay. Okay, important to note that not all ropes are good materials. Uh-oh. Once a rope is collected, it cannot be put back until Lily climbs down the well. Keys are keys. Files are notes, letters, books. Okay. Okay, let's read about this well. After collecting at least one piece of rope material, Lily can climb down into the well. Material quality and length, okay. 
Bad materials will cause the rope to break. Uh-oh. Okay. Once Lily goes down the well, there's no going back. Okay, so I need rope. I need good rope. Instructions can be viewed at any time from the files tab in the stuff menu. Okay. Oh, look at me! Hello! I'm Lily! Your knitting basket gives you comfort despite the stormy weather. Well, give me the... With how big the yarn ball is, it probably could be unraveled into a long rope. Take the ball of yarn, yes, as a rope. Yarn's a good rope! Can I interact with this? I can! <gasps> Look at my outfit! Is that a finger? What's wrong with you? You're already wearing this costume. Do I have other costumes? Blocked. Dang it. Alright, I'm just gonna have to... Can I just click? I can't check these drawers? I guess not. Alright. Uh, okay. Lamp? Lamp! This is what's keeping your room bright right now. Okay. Uh, bed? Your sheets are all messed up from your sudden awakening. I can't use the sheets? Take? Can I take sheets? Prisoners use sheets to escape from prison. Take the sheets as rope. Yes! You take the sheets. Aha! Uh... Okay, how about this bear? Does bear have anything? Sniffle bear, or sniffles for short. Gift from Auntie Shore for your first birthday. Mifuyu? you? Probably not. Kind of stinky, but a good stinky. Attic stinky. I know exactly the type of stinky. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. Can I take? Brave and faithful companion on this quest. The rain isn't good for him. Oh, I hear you. Look at all those trophies. What's this way? Oh, I'm out in the thing. Call a phone number? No, I don't have any phone numbers. No, ah, I didn't mean to do that. Go back inside, go back inside. Okay. What's this? It sits with nobody on it. Where are you usually sit on the couch and knit and watch TV? Can't take the couch, you can see if you can take something from underneath it. Look to see if there's anything good to take, yes? In your search you found your knitting needles! Take them, yes! Okay. Coat rack. Hi, coat rack. Nothing. Trusted family television. VHS tapes in the cabinets underneath the TV, some notable ones. Oh, I can't even... Um... Take? Now isn't the time to watch movies. Okay. The bathroom. Shower is still wet from your earlier bath. Bath has many water safe dolls sitting on the edge. Okay. Take. Even if you stood on the edge of the tub, you wouldn't be able to reach the curtain's hooks. Trying too hard at this will probably result in you cracking your head open on the side of the tub. You have no concept of what an ER is, so you'd be out of luck if that happened. Okay. How about the turlet? Behold! The toilet. Bull has always been a hard-working part of the household. Even after that time, you made potions in it, causing laundry soap puzzle, bubbles to completely fill the bathroom. It also never clogged. Even when you put one of your... one hundred of your... of a yarn ball down it and watch the entire ball disappear in the water. True, the most sacred appliance to be created. I doubt I can... Private potty can't be taken. Look inside the toilet. Sure. Why well, you just wasted time looking inside the toilet bowl? Gross. Even though the commode is kept very clean. Still, yeah, gross. Sink? I'm gonna... If you manage to take this, it'd be impressive. What's in the trash? Fuck. It's empty. Well, that sucks. But you can take the plastic bag out of the trash can, you can't really think of a good reason to. Maybe if you came across a sea turtle that needs to suffocate, you can come back for this. Jesus, that's harsh. What's in the door? Oh. That's just my room. Can I go to the toilet paper? 
Fresh out of the toilet paper next to the porcelain pooper. Save money this toilet paper is single ply. Also known as the worst type of toilet paper. That would be bad rope. Oh, hello. Papa's bed. Uh, always remain tidy as far as you can remember. You weren't even sure if you've seen Papa sleep in it. Okay, can I take the sheets? He tried to take the sheets off, but it seems attached to the mattress somehow. Maybe there were never actual sheets. And the bare mattress just looks like this? That's weird. Okay, let's look in these drawers. In this cupboard here. There's a safe with a keypad on it. it seems to have space for six numbers. Try to open the safe. Okay. This drawer has some of Papa's clothes. Look. Drawer is mostly filled with socks and belts. Those make good ropes. Belts might be a good rope substitute if tied together. Take Papa's belts? Yes. Oh, I'm getting so many ropes. Drawer is some of Papa's clothes. Do not take, take Papa's underwear. Do not. Uh, how about this? Is there like a tie? What is this exact thing that I can't seem to put my finger on? Ha, ah, giggity. No. Alright, well, whatever. Fine, let's get out of here then. Oh, you have to actually go through the bathroom to leave your bedroom? That's weird. What's all this? Book on local plant life in your area. I don't want to do that. What's this? Doors to the pantry. Look. A padlock keeps the door shut. I have no keys. Fridge towers above you. Drawings cover the fridge. There isn't much in the fridge. The grocery delivery hasn't come yet this week. That looks like a key up there. Keyboard, it's where Papa hangs the keys. Next to the board is a note from one of Papa's friends. You can't really read it from down here. Well, logic would dictate, yeah. Why does it make that noise? Climb onto the stool, yes. Oh, what's the regret that read this? Letter addressed to Papa. Dear Tony. Hey, Tony. I hope this letter finds you well. I'm writing to you from Mother's Home as she required extra help regarding the pig farm. She is personally doing well and has asked you about you and Lily. Mother is especially curious about your progress on your research project. When Mother heard that you were pursuing her specialty, she was delighted to see how you would do. Please write to her and possibly send samples. I only expect to stay on the farm for the next year or so before returning to Maine. With your permission, I'd like to visit your home on the way. Thank you for your time, Vic. Well, that was lovely, Vic. Can I take this key? Key to the shed. Should you take it? Yes, of course I should. Okay. Kitchen sink. Macaroni noodles. Stove. It also has an oven. Papa always told you never to use the stove by yourself. Okay. Uh, can I take it? You try to pull at the stove with all your strength, but it seems that a nine-year-old did not lift a gas stove that was manufactured in 1975. What is this? Is this just a table? I think it's just a table. Okay. I can't go out there. I can't... I think it's time to venture out into the world. I think, uh... I think I'm freaking scared. Can I see that lantern? Can I get that lantern? Moths and other bugs love lamps. This is a true fact. Unfortunately, there are no moths because of the rain. Can I take it? Out of your reach because you're a child. Okay. What is this? Your tire swing hangs empty and alone. Can I take it? Uh, your small hands have no hope in tying it. What is this? Are these flowers? 
Push. I, I can't do that. Whatever that is, I can't do it. No. Can I go into the water? No. Okay, can I go this way still? Yes. What is this? There's a pretty big rock on the ground. It's a rock. Okay, can I take the rock? Probably gonna be heavy. Take the rock? No. The vine's growing along on a tree. Large red berries. You've seen birds in the area eating them before. What did it... Okay. Song's starting over. This vine is rooted deep into the ground. It's probably better to cut it down. I don't have things to cut with. I'm assuming it's going to be the same with the rest of those. Okay. Yep. There's the well. This is the source of the voice. All that can be heard now is the echoes of raindrops. If you wish to save the person trapped in the well, you will need to construct a rope. Wait, so I need to actually construct things now. All right, stuff. I have no stuff. Well, I have no sheets, Papa's boats, well, of yarn. Um, sure. How do I, okay, use. What is happening? You can probably knit the yarn you have into a stronger rope. Knit the ball of yarn into a knitted rope, yes. You now have the knitted rope. Three pieces of possible rope? No, wait. There has to be more I can do. That's all I have? Let's see what else I can find. Well then. Oh. Oh, there's there's scissors. Large pair of garden shears are buried in the ground. Take. Children and large scissors usually don't mix. Take the shears? Yes. You took the shears. Cool. And I have a shed key as well. Which I just walked right in. What's this, rope? Extension cord on the floor. Take. Cord is thick and new looking. Take it as rope. What is this thing? An old broken weed whacker has, is left to rust in the corner. It's really nothing more than dead weight. Oh, I thought they, were, they had like... Weed whackers have like the spindly thing that... That do the thing. That cut weeds. Can, I can't take that. A pair of bolt cutters are hanging on the wall. Take. Hell yeah. It's a pretty heavy tool. Take the bolt. Yeah. Hell yeah. What is this? Bag of mulch. Used for gardening. Too smelly. Okay. Well, we got it. Why is it so quiet all of a sudden? What is this? Memorial for someone in a language you don't understand. The memorial says that. On top of the stone is a strangely shaped hole. It's narrow and seems to go down a little over five inches. Papa's been busy. Sprouts are peeking out of the soil. Thanks to the rain, these should be growing into beautiful flowers one day. Cool. Can I take this rope? Chains a bit rusty from the stream's occasional splashing. Can I... James seems like it could be a good rope substitute. Too bad it's welded into the support poles. Okay, I have to be able to use these bolt, cutter, bolt cutters, right? Chain lining the bridge could make for a good rope. Cut and take the chains for climbing. Yes! Take some extra strength, but you managed to snip the chain. You took the chain. I'm so good at stuff. 
Alright, now I think we're we're good, right? Five pieces of popple roll. Time together and begin the descent. Let's do it. Ooh. 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 <laughs> okay, so. What's that? That's a lamp. I can't do anything with the lamp. Can I do something with this drain pipe? No. Okay. Oh, I am at the end of my rope. The rope has come to an end. The way down seems endless, but a darkened window juts out from the wall, from the side of the wall's wall. It's slightly open. You swing closer to take a peek, but you overshoot it and tumble into the pitch black room. What happened? It seems like you landed on something soft. You try to feel around and get a sense of your surroundings. What? I landed in my bed? Lily? Oh, it's Papa. Lily! Papa! Where? I thought... Shh. It's okay, Lily. You just had a bad dream. No, you went to work and there was a voice. A voice? What kind of voice? Uh, it came from the well. Oh, the well? I hope you didn't go near it. The voice sounded like she was in trouble. I wanted to save her. Now, Lily, even in a dream, you need to remember what Papa tells you. But you weren't there. Lily, good girls listen to Papa even when he isn't home. Especially when you hear voices from outside. That's how bad little girls get kidnapped or eaten. What? Will you remember that, Lily? Yes, Papa. Will you? Will you remember it down to your soul? Jesus, dude, back off. Yes, Papa. Good girl. Good night, Lily. Good night, Papa. Under Papa's watch, you quietly go to sleep. What the hell? His words ring through your head as you close, as you lose consciousness. His words ring through your head as you lose consciousness. His words ring. I'm sorry, the fuck what? What? What is that? Okay, Papa just smothered Lily with like a pillow, right? Is, did we all see that? Did we all see what we just saw? We all just, we all just saw that, right? I'm not I'm not losing my mind here. What the ass? Okay, so there's more. So there's more to this than uh, I anticipated. Uh, I lost whatever the hell. I guess I have to find more rope and go down deeper. Or if I, if I take one less piece of rope. Like, um, if I, yeah, I took five pieces of rope. So if I take four, I can swing into that drain pipe. Probably not what I wanted to do, but somehow the window led back into my house. I don't understand what the hell that was about. Okay, very strange, but I'm definitely going to play this episode again, or this game. I'm playing more. We're going to play another episode is what I'm going to say. So, uh, yeah, like the video, share the video, subscribe to Rick Games. It helps me out a whole lot when you do that. Check out the annotations for more videos that I've done. And next time on Rick Games... We're not going to get smothered by our own father. That's what I think. Bye.